African American culture is on full display. In Colorado Springs, yes, that Juneteenth. It's an anniversary where the community comes together to celebrate freedom and each other. My name is Taylor Flowers and I am the 2024 Miss Juneteenth Colorado. Reigning from Colorado Springs, Taylor currently holds the crown. Winning, it feels great each time. It makes me feel really good about myself. Miss Juneteenth has been um, a pageant for many years here in Colorado, as early as the 70s. I was Miss Juneteenth in the 90s way back then. Miss Juneteenth is a national scholarship pageant program designed to encourage young African American women to embrace their diversity and culture while pursuing higher education goals. This national platform aims to showcase the beauty, poise, and rich culture of African Americans. Well, I've been doing pageants since I was like 12. So, you know, I was nervous at first, but once you like keep doing it, being in pageants, it's really less about the competition, more about like having fun with the other girls. It's not all about beauty. The Miss Juneteenth pageant aims to enhance the lives of young black women. They attend workshops, learn etiquette and public speaking, as well as completing community service. Because Taylor is our newest Miss Juneteenth Colorado, she will be competing for the national title of Miss Juneteenth USA this October. She tells us that she hopes to win because this will be her last pageant. Well, I'm going to college soon and it's going to be taking up a lot of my time. So, but I think it's like, the end of a chapter for me. This may be an end of an era for Taylor, but for others. Hi, my name is Cheyenne Fay, and I am your little Miss Juneteenth USA. Cheyenne is eight years old and is from Pueblo, Colorado. Crowned in 2023, she holds the title of Little Miss Colorado and the national title of Little Miss Juneteenth USA. I was about to cry, but I had to hold my teals because I was too happy. Cheyenne loves animals and volunteers with the Humane Society. Now, she isn't big enough to walk the dogs just yet, but she is able to help animals thanks to the gift given to her by the unstoppable civil rights activist and author, Opal Lee. I like to read books to the puppies. I read them this book. At the National Pageant this October, she will be handing off her title to the next Little Miss Juneteenth USA. We want to empower African-American young women in order to um, become their best best selves and we uh, uh, allow them a national platform to do that. Going beyond the standard beauty pageants to magnify and exemplify the black experience and its rich histories through cultural awareness, education, and community service. It's our responsibility um, as uh, keepers of our sisters, right, in order to make sure that we are represented fairly, we are protected fairly, and that uh, we have our voice. Richard Butler, Denver 7.